I've got two days worth of beard growth and we're going to have a shave with the Phoenix Shaving Copper Ascension Twist Adjustable Double Open Comb Razor and a Feather Razor Blade. Yeah, we're going to open up the blade gap a little bit. Coming up next. Hi YouTubers and wet shavers everywhere, it's BarbaraGeorgeTune.com, I'm back with another video. Well, we're going to have a shave with the Phoenix Shaving Copper Ascension Twist Adjustable Double Open Comb Safety Razor. And we're going, to, we're going to use a feather blade. Now, if you've visited this channel before, you know that I prefer mild razors and... Uh, Don't like to have things too aggressive for my skin. Mild razor seems to perform best, but you know what? Copper Ascension is such a nice twist adjustable razor. I think I can tune it to really tame the feather blade because the feather blade is a very, very sharp blade. So I thought I'd give it a try. Feather blade, very, very sharp. A lot of wet shavers love it. And I'm just, you know, cutting to the chase right now. I've already done my pre-shave with the Cube 2.0. And we're using um, John from Shave Soap, from Phoenix Shaving. Boy, I love this scent. And... <laughs> Boom! Lather! Look at that! My gosh! It was like in an instant. I just... Wow! That's absolutely fabulous. Okay, I got my brush scuttle here. I'm going to put the brush in the brush scuttle. I'm using my uh, Star Wisp shaving brush from Phoenix Shaving right there. So let's get right to it. These uh, feather blades came courtesy of viewer Mark Bagwell. Thank you very much, Mark. Really do appreciate it. So we're going to open this up. Just a, a brand new tuck of feather blades. And uh, we're here, boom, got one already. Look at that. Already got one. Put that uh, cardboard signage back in there. Okay, let's just set this aside and let's open up my razor. Okay, okay, here we go. There's the handle. And the one thing I like about this copper razor is that it retains heat. So it's going to give me a really nice warm razor, like a heated razor kind of effect. Because I'm going to hold it under some hot, hot water. So here's my feather blade. Boy, these are, this wrapper is glued in place pretty good here, isn't it? Okay, so there it is. Boy, these are sharp, sharp, sharp blade. There it is right there. High stainless feather, high stainless blade. Okay. So here's my cap right there. I'm going to lay that in there like that. There's the base plate like that. Okay, Let's squeeze that together. Here is my buffer ring. And of course, the shave soap on my face is really kind of doing its thing, moisturizing my skin, softening the whisker. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and snug that all the way up. Blade balance and alignment is beautiful. End tabs are enclosed in the razor head, and the razor head has these little notches here so that you can get a nice grasp of it and, you know, open it up, twist it open and open up that blade gap. So we're going to go a quarter of a turn. We're going quarter of a turn. I got two days worth of growth. Let's heat up the razor and get right to it. You know what? I am going to just put a little more water on here because I want a little more slickness. There we go. Yeah, that's that's good. Just a little more. CK6 likes water and just waiting there. I think it needed just a little more moisture. Okay. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And nice and warm from the brush scuttle, too. Really nice and warm. Okay, now let's heat this up under some hot, hot, hot water. All right. Ooh, good and hot. I'm really getting it, really, really throwing it under the hot water there and letting this, this copper suck in all that heat. And then I'm going to give it a quick swirl or twirl in the sink water there just to kind of bring it to the proper temperature. So it doesn't burn, but it's nice and warm. Okay, here we go. All right, here we go. 30 degrees, a light touch. Let the razor do all the work, gentlemen. 
Boy. That that is that is really nice and smooth and sharp and not at all overly aggressive as I thought it would be. I'm just letting the weight of the razor do all the work. Boy, that's nice. Boy, those, that's really nice. No tugging, no pulling at all. Quarter of a turn to open up that blade gap is a lot for me. Wow, that's, that's, so far so good. Razor head has a lower profile, so it does a really nice job getting up underneath the nostrils. Really, really good. Hey, that's the first pass done. Let's rinse, let's see where we're at. Like to throw a little extra water on there. Well, not, you know what? I gotta be honest with you, not quite socially acceptable because there is two days worth of growth, beard growth there that I'm knocking down. Oh, that's nice and warm from the uh from the brush scuttle. Boy, that's nice. But we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna turn it down a little bit. We're not gonna well, actually, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna snug it up and then I'm gonna turn it back, probably about maybe an eighth of a turn for pass number two. Now, again, I would say it wasn't socially acceptable. It was kind of on the cusp of being socially acceptable, but, you know, could I run out the door? Eh, you know what? Judgment call. Okay. Wow, that's got it. Okay, here we go. Going to heat it up. Well, you know, actually, here's what we're going to do. We're going to snug it up, and then I'm going to turn it back. I snugged up all the way, and I'm going to turn it back about an eighth of a turn like that. Now I'm gonna just 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 drain some water from the sink here. All right, now I'm gonna turn this back on hot. All right, and I'm gonna hold it underneath again and get another nice warm pass from this razor. Ah, that's terrific, terrific, wonderful. All right, here we go with pass number two. We're gonna go east to west across the grain. Boy, that's nice and warm. Boy, that's that's terrific. That is really a nice, smooth shave. This blade is doing a wonderful job. Boy, this razor is a favorite. It really, really is. Boy, that's terrific. That is absolutely terrific. Second pass done. Let's rinse. Let's see where we're at. <laughs> this shave's done. <laughs> this shave, this shave is done. This That is amazing. That is really, really wonderful. Wow. That's fantastic. Two passes, two days worth of beard growth. Feather blade, wow, that's a nice sharp blade and it really, it didn't mess around. Let's go with my two final rinses, one warm, one cold. Here's my warm water rinse.
lot of wonderful slickness there. Boy, that, that is a nice result. Wow. I'm flipping it to the cold water side. Waiting for the cold water. There's the cold water. Cold water rinse to close my pores. Here we go. Ah, a couple of splashes. Marvelous. Clean, fresh towel waiting for me right here. Marvelous. I dare say I could have done a, uh, a third pass, but two passes, I was done. Maybe next time around, I'll do a third pass, snugged all the way up. But this shave is completely, absolutely, 100% done. All right, let's get the uh, Allen Block from Phoenix Shaving with the no slip grip and the uh, dry dock system. And we're gonna go ahead and uh, Run this around here on my uh, newly, cleanly shaved face and see what kind of feedback we get. Any stinging, any zinging? All right, here we go. Wow, you know what? I think a third pass would have really resulted in, you know, hard to say. I've got some zinging here and there. This was really good. Got a little cream right there. Someone probably noticed it already. Hey, wipe that cream off of your earlobe <laughs> or the top of your ear. That's terrific. Yeah, few zings here and there, uh, but uh, man, oh man, nice, smooth shave. Wow, terrific. In the dry dock system like that, let the air in the room do the rest of the work in drying it out. Here's my brush. Let's take a look. I love CK6. CK6 is fantastic. And look, 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 look. Look at that. Isn't that marvelous? That's marvelous. Absolutely fantastic. Just love CK6. This John Frum scent is wonderful. It's uh, gentlemanly. It's adventurous. It is uh, elegant, polite. It's... Uh, you know, it's refined, just terrific. And we're going to go ahead and use the uh, aftershave and cologne and a little bit of the uh, star jelly aftershave balm for upstairs. But first, we'll do this right here, like that. Oh, yeah. That's, uh, that's, <laughs> that's marvelous. I'm getting a little bit of a kick from it. Yeah, and I think that's probably. The feather blade, uh, yeah, the 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 uh, the Allen block gave me a few zings here and there. I think, uh, yeah, the uh, the skin is a little more receptive to the aftershave and cologne. I think it's a very close shave after two pass after two passes. These blades are sharp. They this feather blade did not mess around. Okay, here is the John from for upstairs. About that much is all I'm gonna need right there. Okay, here we go. Did a head shave the other day, so I'm all set. Wow, that was a great shave. Wonderful, wonderful shave. And you know, I think I'm on my way to BBS. I could probably do, I probably could have done a third pass. And uh, the third pass, you know, hard to say how much feedback I would get. I can't say right now. I'm going to have to... Wait two days again down the road and do another shave with two days worth of growth and then do a third pass and see what that is. But uh, do a third pass. But two passes just got the job done. And yeah, I'm this is BBS. I can I can already feel it, you know, stepping into place here. It's BBS. These are phenomenal uh, razor blades. Very, very sharp, nice and smooth. Uh, but the key, I think, is getting a really good razor. And this Copper Ascension razor is one of the better ones out there, if not one of the best. I really enjoy using this razor. I like the twist adjustability. I like the way the copper retains the heat and gives me a nice warm shave. Uh, all the stuff here from Phoenix Shaving really, really did a great job in prepping my skin to really prepare it for uh, this uh, razor blade right here. So, um, yeah. If you've never tried a feather razor blade, 
give them a go, put it in a milder blade, put them in, put these blades in a milder razor, uh, you know, first time out. A quarter of a turn opening up this blade gap for me, that's really, really kind of, kind of going in the deep end of the pool for me. And uh, boy, it just delivered a great shave. Two passes. I dare say that had I kept this snug, snugged up and maybe opened it up at maybe a sixteenth of a, of a turn on the first pass, I probably would have done three passes and uh, it would have been fine. But uh, really, uh, this razor tamed this blade for me and I'm really looking forward to doing another shave with the feather blade and the copper ascension razor from Phoenix Shaving. All right, that's it. Thanks very much for tuning in again. I really do appreciate it. Please share, please subscribe, please like. Hit that bell so we'll give you a yell the next time I upload a video. Comment below, let me know. Check out the executive shaving company, use the code MARK5. Check out my blog, georgetoon.com slash blog for my comic strip George, other cartoons, other videos like this. I'm on Facebook, check out my Facebook page. Check out Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements for some great, great shaving gear. Check out vikingsblade.com for some great shaving gear. Check out my Amazon product page at amazon.com slash shop slash Mark Zerady, where you'll find all the products I review in this channel, organized and categorized, so you can find everything in a snap very easily. Thanks very much for tuning in again. I really do appreciate it. I'll see you again real soon.